This is a really exciting moment for me because this Penstenum, which you probably already know, I adore. This one's called Firebird. And what I did was, towards the beginning of summer, whilst I also took some cuttings of this lovely Penstenum, I also tried to layer it. So what I did was, I got a piece of the stem, made a little nip just in the stem, and then made a little hole underneath the soil, laid the stem over the soil, put some more soil on top, and then put a nice little rock just to keep it in place. So I'm just going to uncover the, the rock, see if there's any roots there. If there are roots there, I'm going to detach it from the plant, put it into its own little pot. And that's a brand new plant, very easily just from putting a stem across the soil basically. So let's see what happens. Let's see if there's roots there. So this is the moment of truth. I'm just going to move the rock Place it to one side. I'm now just going to use this fork and just dig just where the stem is. And hopefully there will be some roots formed. Wow, there is. I won't say there's a great many roots, but there definitely are some roots that are found from that stem. It goes all the way down. So I'm just going to trace it back to the parent and just with the secutors snip it. So that's my layered cutting. There are some pretty smallish roots just on that stem there and that's where that's been in contact with the soil. So firstly I'm just going to take that piece of flower head off and with a big pot I'm just going to lay that down and put some more compost over the top. And because the roots are quite tiny compared to how much growth is on the top I'm just going to take a bit of this top growth out as well because I don't want it to be under too much stress. I've already detached it from, the, from its original part of the plant and that can be stressful enough. So I'll keep an eye on that. I'll make sure it's kept well watered. So that's another plant and a really easy way to produce another penstenum. You can't have enough of them.